Hello everybody, welcome back to the YouTube channel today. I don't know why I started as an intro. Um, that was a little awkward. I know. Well, anyways, <clears throat> how are we all doing today? I know it has been a while since I've done any kind of Overwatch update. Uh, life's been kind of busy, and, um, you know, I, I want to apologize for that. Uh, I've been busy. I know I've been doing the streams and stuff with Resident Evil and Diablo. Um, but I just have not touched Overwatch in a minute. Um, I'm going to be doing that. I'm going to play. I'm going to try out their little new April Fool's game mode. And I'm going to give that a shot. Uh, I, I know I need to do the Patch Amari event. I know that came out. Get a little bit of stuff here. Um, but yeah. So anyways, guys. Let's, um, let's get this kind of... You know, let's get this started, shall we? So, uh, yesterday was April Fools, if you did not know, and so they released a quote-unquote patch notes for April Fools. Now, this only applies to arcade. For anyone who will question throughout the video, this is only in arcade modes. So, if you play the regular game mode, you don't have to worry about any of this. Anyways, let's uh, get going, shall we? Uh, these changes are only being applied to the arcade mode for a moment. Yep, see it says right there. Because Aaron Keller claims he can convene with Pachamari and they told him to make this patch. <coughs> Ooh, sorry about that. He only plays the new arcade mode, so he shouldn't notice otherwise. Here are updates. All heroes have new ultimate voice lines, which is probably the best part. They're all really goofy and funny, and um, yeah, I definitely think y'all should give them a listen to. Keep 50% of the ultimate charge from swapping heroes. Uh, to help these players, I'm not going to read the whole thing because I do have a little bit. Uh, I do got to go in a little bit, so to kind of get this out there, um, yeah, I'm going to do that. So, all heroes have new ultimate voice lines. Keep 50% of ult when charging. Veteran players have advantage when newer ones. <coughs> Sorry about that. Uh, when newer players come into the voice line recognition, in order to level the playing field, we're written and recording new voice lines for every hero. Uh, so it's supposed to even out. Uh, you know, it's just some goofy stuff. Uh, the tank roll passive now gains 10% ultimate charge faster. The hero gets the, the hero that kills the final blow or gets the final blow in the tank gets a significant amount of ultimate charge. It's pretty cool. I don't know why I have these uh, notifications. Anyways. <laughs> Uh, damage roll passive, heal 50 health on eliminations. That's pretty nice, I guess. Uh, support roll passive, gain 30% increased movement speed for 4 seconds when reaching lower HP. Doomfist. Uh, can, his seismic slam can now be empowered by blocks, so if he blocks, he does more damage with this ability. Uh, it does 75, 75 damage more instead of 50. Enemies hit by the shockwave are now launched into the air. <coughs> Uh, D.Va, her defense matrix, after deflecting a def uh, projectile, deals 30 damage to the enemies within the area of its one second effect, which is pretty damn crazy. Defense matrix killing blows grant an additional 5 ultimate, so if you were consistently hitting enemies and then they kept dying to the de defense, you would, and if you were to kill them, you'd get 5% bonus additional charge, which is pretty cool. Uh, Junker Queen applies a bleed to the enemies in range when activated. Uh, I kind of like this comment as this one says like, uh, Junker Queen yells so loud she damages the ear drums of her foes, but it doesn't damage your allies, which is pretty cool. Um, I know I wasn't reading these other ones with theirs, but, uh, you know, I kind of stopped so you guys could read it. Uh, this is gonna be, you know, like I said, a quick video. Uh, Arisa, while in the air, Javelin Spin pulls Arisa forward in her facing direction that's pretty cool so i guess if you jump and then pop ult oh no sorry if you jump and then use the spin uh she'll go forward uh whatever direction she's facing and then fortify increases the falling speed and deals damage in the area when it reach lands on the ground so it's supposed to be she's heavy that's her whole thing Ramatra, Omnic form is now disabled Ramatra is always a nemesis form bonus armor decreased from 225 to 125 but void bearer moved to ability one now has one second cooldown when disengaged so i'm gonna be honest ramacho definitely got nerfed um see if his health was the same 
that would have been good. But he always, no, he's just nerfed the whole time. And eh, I just don't think he would be that good. Uh, give him his health back, and I think he's fine. Ryan, um, I couldn't charge the enemies that were in the air, so I asked Torb to help me out. Now I'm the ultimate crush machine, even in the sky. Charge now grants flight. Hold jump to float and crouch to go down. Steering increased by 33%, so he can now fly. He's a flying tank. <laughs> That's always what we needed anyways, right? Uh, Roadhog, uh, they gave him more range on his hook, so he can now hook you literally across the map. And uh, so get ready to enjoy that even more. Sigma, enemies hit by the knock impact or knock back and experience low grab for four seconds by the rock, so that's pretty cool. And then cooldowns in increase from 10 to 8 seconds, so you can use the uh, rock more. Winston, 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 Winston. Definitely should have said Winton, Winton, Winton. Um, I don't, I don't know if they actually gave him anything though. I don't remember, uh, so I'd have to check in game. <clears throat> Um, Wrecking Ball, his maximum speed is simply increased when bouncing off of walls, and his mind slowly towards move towards enemies, which is pretty crazy. That one's pretty crazy. Um, Zarya's is pretty cool, actually. I think this would be a cool, um, ultimate change in the real game. Uh, her Graviton Surge moves towards her after deploying. So if you are shooting away from yourself, <clears throat> the orb would eventually start to move slowly towards you, which I think is very cool. And then the particle cannon, which is her gun, uh, self knockback on secondary fire scales energy level. So the higher the energy level, the more knockback the enemy gets, which honestly I think is a change that should be in the real game. I don't think that's too strong. So, Ash, uh, this one, I heard she got taken out of the game. Uh, her dynamite, when you explode it, um, so there, the whole thing is, is they want to be more accurate, right? So now the fire spreads between players, which, um, which is pretty cool. So it's pretty neat. Um, and it says right here, fire spreads between the enemies up to four times. Uh, when he's in PP mode, while well, active tactical grenade has a 0.5 second cooldown. Um, that, that's whatever. Oh, wait. I think I understand. Okay, hold up. If that's what I'm thinking it is, then I think what this is trying to say is when he's in his turret mode, every time he's shooting, so he could shoot his bomb and then p consistently technically just shoot his bomb over and over again because this cooldown is only 0.5 seconds, which is actually really crazy. Uh, Cassidy. Cassidy can dodge anything using his cat like reflex. It's a bit rough on his spine, though. Um, dodge all damage when combat roll is active. That's crazy. Uh, ammo reload decrease from 6 to 2. Okay, so that's that's why it's hurt. Uh, now it costs regenerating stamina instead of having a cooldown. I wonder what that means. Um, developer comment, Echo can now use more her fingers when shooting enemies. Tree shot, now fires, so in, instead of triple, it shoots five. Okay, damage is, okay, so it does less damage, but it shoots five, which honestly is pretty crazy. Sometimes Genji heals himself when requesting for healing. <laughs> wow, um, that's a crazy, that's, but that's sometimes, I don't know, okay. <clears throat> and how much healing does it give you, you know? Um, Storm Arrow ricochets towards the Sonic Arrow. Uh, Hanzo spent many years mastering the bow and geometry to pull off. It definitely has nothing to do with magic. Oh, so if you shoot your Sonic Arrow, let's say you shoot your Sonic Arrow at an enemy, the Storm, Arrow sh Storm Arrows, if you shoot in the general direction, will ricochet towards that area where the Sonic Arrow was shot, which is crazy. So if you shoot a Sonic Arrow at a player, does that mean it'll go to the player? It's a good question. Uh, Junkrat. Uh, Jenkro is a bit careless when packing his grenades, so now they pill out of his pocket whenever he knocks himself back. Drops grenades whenever launching yourself with a concussion mine. That's, um, that's pretty crazy. May spawns more pillars and has slightly different configurations. Um, we notice a decrease in May players helping their team group up and spawn with the white, with, with ice wall. This is according to so added additional ice players. <laughs> okay. Uh, rocket launcher deals no self damage and ha- oh my god. 
that needs to be in the actual game, bro. For real. Rockets deal no self damage and has increased knockback. Okay. And uh, barrage can now be. What can now be knocked back while in barrage is active? Barrage now rockets have self knockback. Okay. Fuel de decreased by thirty. Honestly, that's a really great. I definitely think Pharah should have like a ten percent decrease though, and then I feel like you could keep these two and we'd be fine. I definitely think that's a cool. Um, shadow step movement is no longer locked after after getting shot one too many times. Recruits position. Oh, okay. So he could just like pop a teleport, keep moving. That's pretty dope. Uh, power slide now impacts enemies dealing seventy five damage, launching them upward and knocking them down. What the hell? That's ri that's ridiculous. Um. Okay. Whatever. Uh, 76, uh, when he pops his heal, it just now stays on him. So that's good. Sombra, now does 120 damage in the area at the teleport destination. Projectile speed increased from 25 to 240. That's pretty crazy. And cooldown decreased from 10 to 6. So she has faster translocators. Okay. Sentry turret. Turret can now have... Tur what? Turrets can now target enemies while in flight? Okay. Uh, turrets have 60% damage resistance before it's taken to this terrain. Oh, so when they're, like, going to stick somewhere? Okay. Uh, now also, uh, overload, uh, so his super nut mode, oh no wait, no, that's not it, his, uh, his, his convulsion mode basically, where he goes lava man, uh, now causes rivet gun and forge hammer to ignite enemies, <laughs> dealing 30 additional damage, this is crazy, recall, pulls in enemies when activated, uh, okay, and, um, arming time increase from 1 to 2 seconds, Interesting. Um, Widow's Kiss Critical de hits deal de damage over 3 seconds as poison. Widow can now see poison enemies to walls. Okay, so she shoots poison bull bullets instead. Can now headshot enemies? Okay. Nice. Exo Boots. Jumping with Exo Boots can add more horizontal distance scaling with the charge amount. Hold to jump after Exo Boots to keep bouncing. <laughs> okay. Uh, so he's gonna be like a bouncing man, like Pac-Man or something. Uh, whip shot, Brigitte is now pulled towards the flow head. Interesting. Uh, swift step, range increased from 35 to 350, so she can teleport literally anywhere on the map. And cooldown now scales with the distance traveled. So if it's a short teleport, it's a short cooldown. If it's a big teleport, it's a big cooldown. At least it's balanced. Now deflects projectiles, that's dope. The boop. Cooldown, wow. Okay, that's dope. Uh, her gun, wow. Um, wow, okay, so people really like Battle Mercy, huh? Uh, let's, let's give her a hundred and more ammo, and, um, make her shoot <laughs> five times more faster. Got it. Uh, Biotic Orb, pressing the ability input while Biotic Orb causes them to stop. What? Okay, I don't understand that one, but we're gonna have to see that one later. And last but not least, the kick launches Zenyatta in its facing direction when used in the air. Could I, like, always kick? Yeah, that would be cool. Oh, my God. Well, that's awesome. Alrighty, then, ladies and gentlemen. Well, let me know. Oh, yeah. So, if y'all haven't seen, these are the past past notes. Um, yeah, so, these are some past past notes. Terror Sir. So, Arisa's ultimate can be interrupted by hack, annihilation, more armor. And then this is when they nerfed Roadhog a little bit. I think so. Um, they made Wrecking Ball a little stronger, I believe, here. Um, oh, yeah. Ash's thing was pretty cool. If you shoot someone, if Bob's out and you shoot someone, Bob shoots that specific person. I'll kind of let y'all, like, look at these a little bit. Just kind of, like, zoom in through, zoom in through. It's just been a long time since i have genuinely looked at patch notes um so yeah anyways y'all that's all for me today i did not look at the february ones but the february ones it's been too long so i promise next time when um a patch notes comes out i'm gonna definitely start 
bringing it back. Season 3 for me has just been very slow. And uh, I've been doing a lot of other things. So, I work all the time. I got life. It's, I need to get better at my schedule. So, I do apologize about that. But anyways, thank you very much for watching today. Like, sub, whatever you want to do. Leave it a comment. That would be very much appreciated. Anyways, y'all, thank you very much for watching. I love you guys, and I'll be doing better. Thank you. Catch you later. Bye-bye.